Cubs are on their way to Miami. Oof. Goodbye, LA. It's 4 a.m. Yeah, I'm a little tired. Woo. Dropping off old rental car. You were great. Good morning, guys. So we are at the airport. We're getting ready to board our flight. We've been in LA for the whole week. I didn't even vlog because we were literally, we recorded seven podcast episodes and did some meetings and we got to have a little fun too, but go follow me on TikTok and Instagram to like see more of that. I'm here with Brooke and we are headed to Miami with Moroccan oil and I'm so, so excited. It's gonna be so fun. And then we'll head home. We're gals in the ghost today. We've landed. We've got a night ahead, so obviously we're making some element. I told Brooke, I was like, I'm gonna make a concoction. And she was like, what are you making? This is, I, I thought that you were gonna add a bunch of other stuff. This is a simple oh, concoction. Yeah, that'd be funny if I like added like vitamin C. And you started like whipping out like a tincture and like yes. pouring. <laughs> no, just a simple on the go element as we're waiting for our bags and it's raining in Miami. I could cry. <laughs> you guys know how much I love the One Hotel South Beach. Like we literally walked in and Brooke was like, you're home. It is so beautiful. I think these are suites. This is not the standard room and I really am so appreciative and uh, it's just like a breath of fresh air. It feels so nice in here. And there's little branding everywhere. We're here to celebrate their Frizz products, their Frizz Control shampoo and conditioner. And we're gonna watch the Miami Open tomorrow. And we have a tennis lesson Sunday morning, which I'm really excited about. And like how freaking cute. Like I love this visor. We got to pick out little Lacoste sets. So Madewell Sunny is like, oh my God, and tennis balls. Wait, they're bougie Lacoste ones and a clear bag. So I think we need one for the stadium and I'm really glad because I did not bring one, but you will find me lounging right here. What's over here? Some PJs, Moroccan oil colors, of course. Slip eye mask and look at the bathroom and the bathtub. I have my own room for this. And oh, well, this, this is beautiful. I'm really glad about all these hair products. Like Moroccan oil literally smells so good. It's honestly so nostalgic for me. And I did not bring sunscreen. So anything from La Roche Posay is gonna be amazing. Again, here, shampoo and conditioner. Oh my gosh, ugh, I need to like smell this stuff. I love this shampoo and conditioner so much. I need to smell it again. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to think of like what year of my life this smells like. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. body shower. We're drinking tonight. I'm here with Moroccan oil. We're celebrating their Frizz Shield Spray, which is honestly amazing because it's rainy and humid. But we're going to Carbone tonight. We have a cocktail hour before, and since there's a rain delay tomorrow, we get to sleep in, and we're going to like the evening session instead of the evening match. So I'm in the mood to like get Lydia. I'm in Miami. Um, you know, just like a little buzz. But so I thought it'd be fun to do a little drink while I get ready. This is the Plant Botanical Vodka Seltzer, strawberry mint. Let's see how it is. Anything with vodka, I'm in. It's good, I've never really had a mint drink now that I think of it, like that kind of drink. Look how cool this My Hair Tools bag I got is. I got it at a store in the West Village and it's so perfect. It has like little heat protection in here and I can fit multiple things in there. I've gotten a little too confident with how long it takes me to get ready um, because Brooke, oh, she's FaceTiming me. Hello. Hello, you're on my vlog. Oh, hello, vlog. <laughs> I'm just uh, now starting getting ready. I was just saying how I've gotten a little too confident in myself with how fast I can get ready. I said, I, I said, I said six o'clock, well, I said we have about an hour, what did I say? We have about an hour or something and you were like, oh, no, that's plenty of time. Oh, well then you said 6.30, so. I was oh, like, oh, I didn't know you were. Oh, I didn't know you obliged. I yeah, I decided I would oblige. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm not. I'm. I don't always claim to be right. Vlog. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I was just saying, I really can get ready fast. I've just been 
lounging. Danielle can get ready very fast. <laughs> I would say half the amount of time is me, honestly. I was saying you've made me confident in that, so. Um, but yeah, I just like didn't start till just now. I cracked open a little vodka seltzer. <gasps> oh. They're good. <laughs> oh, that dress is beautiful. Thank you, um, but I only have these shoes. Do you think I can make that work? Oh, definitely, that's so cute. Okay. Yeah, why wouldn't... No. I wish I brought black, but I these are comfortable, so at least I won't complain. Yeah, and those will just, like, go better for your, the rest of your trip. Yeah, uh, that's what I thought. This is the real only, like, club night, you know? Yeah. I love it. Brooke called <laughs> just to check in. It's not like we've been together all week. That was really sweet of her. She wanted to show me her outfit. I have been obsessed with the House Labs foundation. I see the hype. Um, and I actually blended it with this NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation because Kat used it on me when I did Amazon Live with her. And uh, I liked how it looked. And honestly, the House Labs is like my spray tan shade. And you know, I haven't gotten a spray tan since last Saturday and it's Friday now. But I've been using the Jurgens um, like gradual tanner lotion every night before bed. So I think it's helped keep up the tan, but like, you know, I'm so excited. I literally love Miami so much. Like, honestly, I was telling Brooke this and I was talking to Ryan about it. I always talk about how I would love to move. Like I've always said before I, like if I do move back to Tampa one day, like before I do that, I want to move to like one more city. And you know, maybe it's like a Dallas or a Nashville, but honestly, I know like Tampa, Miami, still both in Florida, but like, I love Miami. I don't think I could live here forever, but I think it'd be fun to have a little stint here. But then I like wouldn't be staying at hotels in Miami. So I always wonder, but I thought that's how I'd feel about, I, I didn't think that's how I felt about New York, but I was curious to see if I'd like living in New York as much as I did visiting New York. And I indeed do, but you never know. So I'm literally like double fisting. I honestly need to chug my element first before I drink this vodka seltzer but I'm so excited. It's always fun going on brand trips and seeing like who else is here. Sometimes they'll give you the guest list beforehand. Like when they invite you, this is who else is already confirmed. Or sometimes I'll ask if I am curious. I'm a nosy Nelly, I wanna know. Um, and then sometimes I'll just show up and see who's there. And I usually know somebody, which I'm really grateful for because I've met so many people throughout the years. We ran into Mary Skinner in the lobby so I'm excited that she's here. And then Brooke told me Sydney Tilton is coming. My friend, our friend Clark, who was on the podcast recently, she responded to my story and was like, see you there. Um, Emily Billings, Olivia Marcus, I heard they're here. I'm just like hearing bits and pieces, but I'm so excited. And then one of our friends, Maddie, like put on this event and she's so amazing at her job. So I'm excited to see her and everyone on the team. I'm just so grateful. I am so grateful. I can't believe we went from one, one hotel in West Hollywood to South Beach. It's so on brand for me, honestly. And um, I'm grateful that I got to, we got to kind of work with one hotel West Hollywood while we were there. Um, Cause you know what? I've given this hotel a lot of my money. Um, so it's nice to be able to work with them. I feel like I'm not doing my makeup well because I'm like trying to talk to you guys, but that's okay dedicated to the vlog but i'm like is the makeup good is there more light oh my god didn't that just change everything anyways i'm gonna listen to some drake because i'm in miami and i will get back to you Right, hair is done. We're doing the damn thing. We're wearing hot shorts, but um, I don't have, I, there's no way I'm just wearing this. So I'm gonna wear a blazer over top, but you have this little Prada tank. These little, they're called hot shorts from Retrofit. Um, well, they're not called that on Retrofit, but it's the trend that I see. Um, but I wore tights with it, a little below the belt belt. The blazer kind of, Pulls it all together and then my high knee doesn't show as much. But I'm obsessed and I don't care what anyone says. We're gonna head down for cocktails. I'm trying, I'll just say I don't need to chug this. Like, but yeah, um, I'm excited to see 
Who else is here? And I love the fit. Okay, just kidding. I went with the boots. I hope that's not a mistake, but I just felt a little naked. I know it's like the point, but I like the boots better. Okay, now I actually have to go. Guys, we have the best group here. All the girls, say hello. I am so obsessed with this group of people. This is so hard to drink. Pouring rain. Miami! How we doing, Miami? Oh my gosh, look at all the flood! Brooke immediately connected to Ox. So we're in the red room of Carbone and apparently Drake has been here. So that's all I need to know. He has private parties here. Yeah, he's got private, but he's actually here tonight. Wow. Wow. Sophia's doing an alpha video. We're all gonna watch. What cheer are you on? to document this we ended up at some random estate and now me and Emily are going home <laughs> home sweet home oh it's dark in here did they do turn down service no they didn't I kind of left it a mess in here we ended up you guys wait I'm gonna switch to my vlog camera it's 1 42 which for me is late but I know in Miami like the night has just begun like they were talking about going to 11. And I've always wanted to go there, but like, you don't even get there till two or three. And I just can't, like, I can't do it. Um, but um, it, tonight was so fun. Like, they curated the best group of people. Like, I feel so lucky I've met each and every one of the girls who's been on the trip. And I mean, it's if I hadn't, that would have been fun too, but it's cool because all of us kind of know each other already or follow each other. And the dinner was so fun. We had our own private room and like our waiter was so nice and we just, the food was so good. Like I'm just feeling very grateful and I just love Miami so much. So we were at dinner and then they brought us back on the party bus and then like a few of us, one of our friends had a friend of a friend of a friend of a friend who has this like estate. Um, and they were having a party and it literally looked like a club in there. It was crazy. So we were there for a while and then a few of the girls left and then I stayed like an extra 30 minutes and me and Emily left. So it was fun. But now I'm like, if I was home right now, I'd be making toast with butter. That's like my favorite snack. And I don't think room service is open right now. And I also don't need that. I just want like, like a little snack. My ears are ringing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> One thing I love about the one hotel is they have these. Actually, the one in LA did not have it. But you have like a personal water fountain here, which I love because I'm a thirsty girl. I'm going to head to bed, setting no alarm. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning, rainy Miami. I slept so well last night. Like, my gosh. Oh, the best feeling ever. We're here in the bathroom again. We um, have a change of plans today. I think I might have mentioned yesterday. But basically, we were supposed to go to the day match today. And now we are going to a night match. So but they're doing our hair with the amazing Frizz Shield spray. Everything like that. But it's like they want us to come with damp hair. So I'm going to blow dry my hair a little. And I'm gonna have my makeup done, I think, is what they want. 
Um, and then they're, we're going to Soho House for lunch. And then from there, we will go to the Miami Open for the night match. And I think the rain will have cleared off by then. I'm obsessed with my SkinCeuticals Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I'm like a hyaluronic acid girly now. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty well rested. I slept till 10, which I think is pretty good. I love this makeup bag too. I got it off Amazon. I just like, hey, can see everything on top and it's really satisfying. I kind of was rushed yesterday, so it's a little unorganized now, but I'm gonna do my makeup and I'll check back in with you guys and then I'll come back. I'm gonna like wear something casual down there and then we're gonna get dressed after the fact and I can't wait to show you guys my outfit. Okay, I did most of my makeup except for the eyes. I'll just do that when I get back. Um, I'm so excited to show you guys my outfit. I just made another element with a water. Hair is pretty much damp. My hair is getting so long, how crazy. And I'm just wearing like sweats in a tank. Wow, winters, cold coffee. I need to turn that off. And I'm uploading a YouTube video. And this and that. And rattle a tat. We're gonna, I kind of want, I mean, I know it's like a rainy day, but I kind of want to do like a slick straight hair situation because I always do body. Like, I want to see it like, I don't know, it's kind of what I'm feeling. Or beachy waves could be nice, but the outfit I'm wearing is very like sleek polished. I can't decide. I guess we'll find out very soon. just was steaming my outfit I'm wearing today. We're gonna pretend, well apparently by the time we get to the match it's gonna be sunny at like 5 p.m. which I'm so excited about. So this is my little set. I'm so excited to put it on. Little white linen moment. Fun fact, Sophia Richie Grange wore this during her wedding weekend um, and it like went viral and it was so hard to get and then finally it came back in stock and it has this little thing in the back here that you can cinch, so I don't know if I should do that once I put it on. Might need help, not sure there, but um, I do need to finish my makeup because I didn't do my eyes before. Um, and we're gonna get dressed. I gotta figure out the jewelry. I'm thinking simple earrings, like either these or like the classic Bottega dupes and maybe one bangle um, and some rings perhaps. Okay. How good. So I went with these little Bottega dupe earrings. These sunglasses are Amazon. I love them. And then this set, it's just so cute. I feel like I'm gonna wear this all summer long. And then I'm just wearing a little Dolce Vita. Ooh, my tripod. Mini, mini, mini heeled sandals because I'm sure it's gonna be lots of walking. And I'm gonna go meet Brooke. I'm gonna take a couple pictures and then head downstairs. I think we're in that same party bus which will be so fun. And then, yeah, I don't think we're coming back for the day. So I've got to like prep myself, but let's go. We're going to Soho House for lunch and then the Miami Open. Everyone looks so good. All the outfits, like, so good. In the party bus again, but the vibe is a little different now. <laughs> We're prim and proper girls on our way to the open. My plate is so random, I love it. We all got like the most random things because they have so many great assortments. Salmon and macaroni and cheese. Yes. <laughs> grounds now this is so fun it's giving Coachella I don't know how to explain it we're at the Moroccan oil little pop-up here and oh it's the most beautiful time of day 
it literally feels like Coachella. We're in the Lacoste store right now and it is so cute. Everything is like so preppy, so fun, so preppy. It's so preppy. <laughs> it's so preppy. Okay. Olivia, how are we feeling post Miami Open? We love the Miami Open. We love um, it. We I had a blast. Speak for everyone. I'm a tennis <laughs> fan now, and I spent three hundred dollars. We? I store. didn't know you bought anything. I went to one match. <laughs> Did you buy a t-shirt, a sweatshirt, and a hat? I bought a tank top, a sweatshirt, and a hat. No, you yeah. didn't. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, Maddie, what'd you buy? I bought a Lacoste hoodie, the same one Sophia bought, because Yay. I am a tennis fan now. I am. We are so all tennis athlete. fans. And we're going to test out our skills tomorrow. We're literally taking a tennis lesson tomorrow, you guys. Get ready. Gonna, who do we think is going to be the best? I think Sydney, despite her being No, Sydney <laughs> just said she was going to be the best. Because she's athletic. Sydney's going to be the best. I'm not athletic. I play pickleball. I, I will like say I'm not going to be the worst, but I'm not going to be the best. How about that? I can hold you. Hi. We're back. Um, got to watch the number one male tennis player in the world play. Carlos Alcaraz. Or Al yeah. I think I said that right. I just got my room service. I'm so happy. I got chicken tenders and french fries. Um, the Miami Open is so fun. And Sydney was trying to convince us to go to John Summit tonight. And I was like so game. But it's midnight. And she was like, but we probably won't go to t till 2 or 3. I need to go somewhere now. Like, I'm keeping my, my makeup on for, like, 20 more minutes. And, if like, I want to, like, I just love Miami so much. Like, I just like to dance. But I can't hang with the whole, like, you know, the DJ doesn't come on till 2 or 3 a.m. situation. Like, that's just not me. So maybe I'm not built to live here, honestly. But I'm kind of, like, I'm not tired. I'm kind of tempted to see what's on the TV. I feel like I never turn on the TV when I'm in hotels, but I'm tempted. I'm gonna FaceTime Ryan too. But today's been so fun. This is just the best group of girls. Like, I can't stop saying that. They're so fun. <laughs> I woke up at 7.30, but I wanted to like have a morning. Ow. Trying to open these eye patches. The shower felt so good. We have a tennis lesson this morning. I went on Instagram live last night and everyone was just like being silly and everyone was like, you need to bring this more to the vlogs, which I feel like I do, but maybe I don't. And if so, Let's be more silly. Hi, Bashes. Gonna post a YouTube video. We check out later today, which is so sad. And I don't wanna pack because as I showed you guys, I think last night, my suitcases have erupted. Like I just, when we were leaving from LA, I just threw everything. And then when I got here, I just ruined it even more, which is so not me. Like it's honestly so unlike me, but. Sunday morning, one of my favorite times of the week. It's gonna be a beautiful sunny day in Miami. I'm gonna put on this little Lacoste um, little dress with shorts. It'll be good. most ideal Sunday morning. I don't know what came out of me, but I said I want chocolate chip pancakes. Always gotta have my eggs with a little protein. My decaf coffee. This looks so good. I'm making a thumbnail. Ah! All right, we got the set on. The socks are literally Lacoste socks. They're so cute. I ended up doing makeup because everyone is like wearing glam, they said. So I love it though. They gave, some people are wearing sets. I, I wonder if anyone else is wearing a dress. I wonder if everyone chose the set, lol. Oh, but um, it's so cute, we have the little shorts underneath. And we're gonna head down. First time touching Coffee around time. Yeah, the party bus exactly. yeah. to the tennis yeah. lesson. Yeah. 
Let's go. It's I'm very a different excited. vibe to the party bus each time we get on. I know. It's okay. like one time we're in tennis outfits, one, one time we're in a like tsunami. No, like literally. To <laughs> Off to car floating to carbone. <laughs> and now we're wholesome girlies taking a tennis lesson. Well, we will start with tennis soon, but for now we're taking photos before we get sweaty. This is so funny. <laughs> We did it. We have battle scars. Brooke slayed. Brooke went to the intermediate area. I no, went to the beginner okay, area. Okay, well they said, has anyone played tennis before? If you have, go over here. And physically I have played tennis twice, but I... Twice. Twice, just in case you were wondering. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, have you seen the video oh, of Oprah where she's yes, like, I've, I've seen, seen the, the film now twice. twice. Yes. Um, no, yeah, I literally haven't played since I was a kid. So I was like, I'm, I'm glad I did what I did. And then we all played together, which was fun. Yeah, very fun. Um, Sophia is a boss. She's so good. She's so good. Yeah, she, she like is the type of person to sell herself short. Like she's like, oh, I was on JV. Like, and then no, like is insane. Yeah. Like, I feel like I'd be like, no, I've played twice. And then like, yeah. I do really bad. <laughs> no, I know. So yeah. we're going to go back and pack up. This was so fun. This was a good like Sunday boost of serotonin, like in yes. the sunshine. Like, oh, it's the most beautiful day. It's so stunning. I'm so happy. Mary, how are you feeling post tennis lesson? Wow, you look perfect. I'm feeling hungry, but also like I did better than I thought I would. You did. You so did amazing. Proud of myself. Aw, really pat yourself on the back. <laughs> I love this lobby so much. I really didn't think I would see this happen. I'm so happy I got both suitcases squared away. Ooh. Both the extenders are out, of course, but I've been gone for a week and I've acquired product, which I'm so grateful for. Oh my God. Hopefully they're nice to me when I check in my bags. I don't think you guys understand how sad I am to leave. I mean, you probably do. If you know me, you know how sad, but it's time to go. I have stuff to do this week. Of course, it's the most beautiful day of the day we leave, but I'll be back. I always will be back. And this has been the best trip ever. My flight legit just got delayed. I wish I had a swimsuit on, but I'm just gonna go to the beach in my sweatpants. Why not? I just sat in the sand. I was like, we're doing it. I'm gonna sit in the sun and take in the moment. I'm glad that I know now. I was about to just go to the airport, but now that I know my flight's delayed, I'm glad I didn't just go because I would've been there longer. So I'm just gonna enjoy the Florida sunshine. It's so weird being like, I mean, Tampa's like four hours from here, but I feel like close to home, but not. It's like a weird feeling. <laughs> that vitamin D will last me all week. That was incredible. I really need to move back to Florida one day. I do. I love New York so much though. I can't leave New York yet. At the airport food court and I got this moho pulled pork bowl. It came with like potato, sticks and I was like I'm gonna take those off but no, I mean I feel like they'd be good but just not with this anyways I'm gonna enjoy this and hopefully my flight doesn't get delayed anymore <laughs>